Hey students, I hope you have gone through the previous clip in that we have studied about the types of teeth and the structure of a tooth. In today's class, we will be studying about how to take care of teeth and about microbes, their benefits and their disadvantages, that is how they cause disease, how they are harmful. So these are the topics we will study for today. Okay, so we are going to first study about how to take care of our teeth. Okay, what are the things we have to do? We should take care of our teeth to avoid dental problems as the first thing. Okay, you have to take care of your teeth. Once your uh, uh, permanent teeth grows, then it cannot be, uh, like uh, if it uh, comes out, your next set of teeth will not come out. So you need to really take care of your teeth. Okay, brush teeth wiser day that is to remove food particles that are stuck to your teeth so you have to brush teeth twice a day avoid using pointed objects to clean gaps between teeth and use dental floss instead okay mm, you can use that don't use sharp things or it may even hurt your gums or hurt your teeth also rinse mouth after every meal you have to rinse and clean your mouth with water using water after your meals eat fruits vegetables nuts milk products regularly avoid too many sweets okay like chocolates and different sweets avoid eating too many of them drink a lot of water visit a dentist for checkups try to go uh, visiting dentists uh, frequently for your tooth checkup all right calcium and vitamin c they are very important for you because they keep the teeth and gums healthy now see if you do not brush properly, germs it changes to sugar. Okay, the germs change sugar in the food into acid, and this acid will stick to your teeth like paste-like material that is called plaque. Okay, and this plaque it weakens the enamel and even makes cavity. Thus, your teeth you have to take care of your teeth. All right, now next topic we'll go to is microbes what are microbes they're tiny living organisms which we cannot see with naked eyes we can see only through an instrument called microscope okay these are very tiny living organisms all right microbes uh, microbes they are found everywhere they are found in air they're found in water soil food okay they're even found inside and outside human body all right, they are found even in the human body and even in animals also. Now, like other living organisms, microbes, they need even food, moisture, oxygen, temperature to survive and multiply. All right, like we also need food, right, for our survival. Similarly, microbes also, they need for their survival. survival. Some microbes, they are useful and some even they are harmful. Okay, there are four main kinds of uh, microbes they are virus bacteria protozoa and fungus okay first we will see how they are useful in what way they are useful we'll see a few example examples like yeast it is used to make bread and bun lactobacillus bacteria they change milk into curd, curd. you all love curd right i know it okay so that's how lactobacillus bacteria it changes milk to curd and it's helpful for your digestion process also um uh, these microbes it helps in digestion of food and it even helps to decompose dead plants and animals see now if these dead plants and animals would not be decomposed your environ environment would be in very bad condition so microbes it helps to decompose even dead plants and animals and it keeps environment clean and safe now how they are harmful all right they cause diseases okay dangerous diseases they cause like we can see a few examples like bacteria it causes typhoid tuberculosis pneumonia virus chicken uh, uh, sorry common cold polio chicken pox okay virus diseases all right these are viral diseases protozoa it causes malaria nausea abdominal pain and bloating all right fungi it causes athlete's food ringworm so these are certain examples i've given a few disease how this microbes cause okay so this is the end of your lesson please go through once again to make uh, your lesson clear. Okay, go through both the clips. Thank you.